everyone, welcome to the Explorer. I'm Miss Jane. I'm Quan Pang. Today you will look at reading comprehension. Take out your level 5 workbook. Please turn to page 37, pre-used PSR model paper 3. And this is the question that I gave you last week. Now I'm going to give you answers later. Uh, what I want you to do is to take a look at question number 6. There is a mistake, a, a missing word in question number 6. Since this is the first day of the class, so the word first is not written here. Okay, so can you add in the word first? These are the answers to the 20 questions I gave you last week. Alright, so please check the answers mark on your own and uh, take a look at question number 6. This is the question that I asked you to add in the word first. Since this is the first day of the class, the teacher decided to, the answer is break the ice by playing a game. Now, do you know the meaning of break the ice? Chinese is poor being See, so usually if you go to any places, right, the first time you don't know anyone. You don't know anyone. You don't know anyone. You don't know anyone. So if you want to know those people, you can go to the first time. They will have a game. So that game is for you to know, for you to know the people. That game we call it Ice Breaking Games. Right, so the answer here is to play a game and those games is to break the ice. So that's the meaning A, right? So answer. The rest of the questions, I hope you have checked the meaning of words on your own and you can mark the answers now. Next, turn to page 44. Right, look at page 44. You need to read the details of the attractions. So there are three places. Number one, the sea wall. Two, a Amazon calling. And the third one is dive reef. Okay, so these are places. 全部都是地方, right? So these地方可以看到什么? So what you need to do is you need to read. Alright, for example, sea wall. What are the attractions in the sea wall? You can watch sea creatures, you can feed tortoises, you can take a look at turtles and you can hold a starfish. Now I have given you some words and also some pictures you know, to show you the meaning of certain words. Okay, so if you don't know, you can see it. Alright, then next is the time that you can go, 9am to 8pm. And how much money do you need to pay if you want to go to see these places? Sibo, 80 ringgit for adults, 成人, 65 ringgit is for children. And you get a free Sibo rack, a keychain, so you can get a free one. Alright, and then there's a number for you to call if you want to make a booking. Alright, so that's for Sibo. The second one is Amazon Calling. So Amazon Calling, is a he says experience the Amazon River replica in Kuala Lumpur, right? So it is not in Amazon, not in Amazon, is a foreign Malaysia. But you can see the same thing. Replica is the same thing. Alright, the same So if you look at the picture, uh, this is one. Alright, that where you can go for a cruise, like how uh, you sing. Uh, Okay, she um, sit right in a glass boat. Hangxing, okay, not you using Hangxing, okay, right on a, uh, right in a glass boat, and you need to pay sixty five ringgit for adults, forty five ringgit for children. All right, okay, and you also get a free I love Amazon T shirt. So that's what Amazon calling. And the last one is dive reef. Dive is 潜水. Reef is, look at the picture, 那种, 就像珊瑚, okay, 珊瑚那种, that you call reef. Right, so dive, 潜水, with the sharks, 
swim with the manta rays. So look at the picture. Manta rays is a kind of fish, all right? And then sea sea, sea creature, right? Then you can also uh, see other uh, pictures of seahorse, all right? And the time is 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. And this is more expensive. 200 ringgit for adults. 成人两百块, 如果你要参加这个活动, and 100 ringgit, 150 ringgit for children below 12 years old. Alright, you can get free photo, but you have to book one month ahead. 就是提前的一个月要去做booking先. And if you want to know more, then you can call the number given. Alright, so what I want you to do is to read again. 一定要读多一次,自己读,明白先写,那些不会的字写上去, okay, pictures to show you, right, that you understand. Okay, after you have read and understood the details of the attractions, then only you take a look at the questions. Questions 23, A, B, and C. Now, you're going to answer questions 23A, B, and C on your own. Okay, so I just help you by telling you the meaning of the question. So question A, you can look at page 44. Question A, if Henry likes sea creatures, which attraction will he go to? See, if he likes sea creatures, so you check. Look at the details of the attractions and you check where is the word sea creature. Okay, you can find the word sea creature, underline, or you can highlight. And what is the place? So look at the top there and you get the answer. Okay, B, how much does Mr. Anand has to pay for his 15-year-old son to enter the dive reef? So you have to look at dive reef. Dive reef. Mr. Anand's son is 15 years old. 十五岁,他的儿子,十五岁,他的孩子十五岁. Okay? How much money does he need to pay? Check. He said, RM200 for adults. 两百块是给成人. RM150 is for children, and the children must be below 15, uh, 12 years old. 孩子呢,一定要少过12岁就还这个钱。那么,如果多过12岁的还什么钱,还几多呢? Okay, can you try on your own? Question B. Question C. I don't have to tell you what to do. I only want you to check the answer by taking a look at the details of the attractions. Okay, 一定要看,然后才写。Right? Okay, you just need to match the phrase in list A to the phrase in list B. Okay, so that's for A, B, and C. Okay, you can pause first. 停一下, 做完先, then only you continue. D. Question D. Would you go to the Amazon calling? Why? See, there are two answers, two questions here. Two questions means two answers. So the first question, would you go to the Amazon calling? Okay, so of course the answer is a very simple answer. You can say, yeah. So yes or no. If your answer is yes, yes, I would go to the Amazon calling. say yes only. Alright, yes, then I, subject, verb, would go to the Amazon calling. Who stop? Next answer, 写在下面, Why? So this is because. Okay, this is because. Now go back to this passage, alright, read the details of the attractions and then you can see why you to the Amazon calling. Why? Okay, check and see. To look at the first line, I've experienced the Amazon River replica in Kuala Lumpur ride a glass boat along the Amazon. Okay, experience means 体验. Okay, so if you go to this place, you can experience 
好像在 Amazon River ride 一个 glass boat. Okay, glass boat. You understand what is a glass boat? 就是 boat made of glass. Okay, 你要去吗？要。为什么要去 ？So you can use this answer to write. Okay, use this answer to give the reason. Would you go to the Amazon calling? So first, first answer, yes, I would go to the Amazon calling. This is because 我要体验 Can you write on your own? 我要体验 How to say I? I want to experience. Okay, or I would like to experience. 我要体验什么？你要体验什么？那个 Amazon River replica in Kuala Lumpur. I would like to experience the Amazon River replica in Kuala Lumpur by riding a glass boat. Okay, by riding a glass boat along the Amazon. Okay, so that would be a long answer if you want to.、Um, If you want to copy the whole sentence, 所以不会的话你就可以抄啊。就你要体验吗 ？OK， 如果你会自己写的，你就讲你要去。为什么？因为你不曾 ，OK， 不曾坐过一个 glass boat， 你不曾坐过一个 glass boat， 所以现在你要去体验，可以啊。Can you write on your own? Can you try writing out on your own? 不曾不曾体不曾坐过。I have never. I have never ridden R I D D E N. I've never ridden in a glass boat. Okay, 就是不曾坐过 Alright, okay. So think and you write on your own. Okay, so I'm not going to help you anymore. So D question you write on your own. You can pause for a while. 停下先，写完 Then only you continue with E. Question E, Yuna. Okay, Yuna is a girl, right? Would love to see a sea shark and a a seahorse and a shark. Okay, I repeat. I、right? sentence question E, Yuna would love to see a sea horse and a shark. Which attraction is the most suitable for her? Give your reason. Okay, check and see. If she wants to see a seahorse, okay, or a shark, which is more suitable? 她要看一个 seahorse， 她要看一个 shark. Alright, 哪一个 attraction is more suitable? So the attraction that you write, you will write the answer. Sea World, or the Amazon Calling, or Dive Reef. Okay, so that's the meaning of which attraction is the most suitable for her. 哪一个是比较适合 ？So 哪一个 attraction？ 所以你要写啊 ，Sea Sea World， 或者 Amazon Calling， 或者 Dive Reef. Okay, 然后 give your reason. 为什么你要？帮他选择哪一个 attraction 比较适合 ？OK， now let's take a look at Sea World. Can you can Yuna see a seahorse and a shark there? Yes, of course. 为什么？你看那边写了吗 ？Watch sea creatures. So sea creatures, seahorse 也有啊 ，shark 也是有的。OK， so Sea Sea World 也可以去看的。Amazon calling? No. 这边是去，呃、uh, ，you ride in a glass boat. 这边没有的 ，OK? Dive reef, yes. 这边你要去看，你也要 dive 的 meaning of dive， 潜水，你可以潜水去看的。Sea world 是不需要潜水的，只看罢了。有可能 ，you know, it is just an aquarium, right? Then you can see the sea creatures. All right. So there are two answers now. One is a sea world, another is dive reef. 哪一个比较适合 Yuna? Yuna is a girl. 
Okay, so of course, 那个没有这样危险的，对吗 ？Okay, so for me, I think it is 没有这样危险的。So you should choose the one, okay, where she does not need to dive. 她不需要潜水去看的，所以你就选那一个了。Okay, 这是选 attraction 谁先 ？Okay, reason. This is because. Some. This is because. Look. Seahorse dive reef. Seahorse, it doesn't need to dive. How do I say? It subject verb. It doesn't need to dive. It's called dive. She does not. She does not need N E E D. She does not need to dive. D I V E. 潜水啊 She does not need to dive in order to see a seahorse and a shark. Okay, 她不需要去潜水。如果她要看这个 seahorse 跟那 shark， 她不需要潜水。加到一个 ，it is not dangerous, okay? Or it is less dangerous. 没有这样危险。Full stop. So two sentences to give as the reason, okay? I repeat, right? 你教他选的，你帮他选的是那一个不需要潜水的，然后又没有危险性的，所以你就给这样 as the reason. Alright, and the attraction is to write the name only. 那个名字吧，啊 ，Sea World 或者 Dive Reef. Can you think and write on your own? 不明白再听懂我讲一次，然后就写。Turn to page forty-six. Now, if you don't understand, you have to listen to me. Write the meaning of words that you don't understand at the top of the difficult word. Right? Okay. So let's take a look at the library duty roster. Look at the words at the top there. Study the library duty roster. Duty roster is 值日表 Okay. And this 值日表 is for the librarians. Librarians 就是图书馆员 Okay. So what are the their work, their duties in the library? So you can take a look at Monday from Monday to Friday, all right. So there are four different types of work. The first one is arrange tables and chairs. Second one, wipe the shelves and counter. Wipe, wipe 就是抹 ，okay， 抹那些那些橱啊，那 shelves， 架子啊 ，right. And the counter, counter is the 呃柜台 ，okay. Then arrange books on the shelves and the last one, sweep the floor. All right. So and you can see different names. See, so every day somebody that would be the librarian side will have to work in the library. All right, then you can read a dialogue. The dialogue between Badro and Mr. Lee. Badro says, "Good morning, Mr. Lee." Mr. Lee says, "Good morning, good afternoon." Good afternoon, sorry. Good afternoon, Mr. Lee. Mr. Lee says, "Good afternoon, Badro." Where are the rest of the librarians on duty today? They should be here by now. See, so. Um, Mr. Lee is asking Badro what happened to the rest of the librarians, and uh, Badro say Julie and Kai are having lunch at the canteen. They finished their lesson a bit late just now. Beatrice is in the restroom. Okay, the restroom is a could be a toilet, right? The restroom is a toilet. Raman is on his way from the staff room. He helped his teacher carry some books just now. All right, so these are. Uh, the people who are supposed to come for their duty in the library, all right? And Mr. Lee say, I see it's almost 2 p.m. now. The afternoon session is starting soon. You can start your duty first. And Bajo say, All right, Mr. Lee, I'll start my duty now. Okay, so a very simple、um, dialogue. And I think you can understand the passage easily. Now, if you can't understand, please. Read again. 再读多一次才可以答那个 page forty seven 的问题的
All right, now turn to page 47. Questions that you can answer on your own is question 24A and B. So look at question 24A. Based on the library duty roster, Badro is responsible to... Okay, it's very easy. What you need to do is take a look at the Zerubiao, okay, and check where is Badro's name. Okay, can you find Badro's name? And you see what Badro need to do. That will be your answer. Okay, 找 Badro, 那就看他的工作是什么? That's the answer. Okay, you can underline and then after that, put a tick, you know, beside the answer. That's A. B, the dialogue takes place on, so the dialogue means, 那个对话, Badro and Mr. Lee 讲话的时候, 是在星期几的? Okay, how do you know whether it is a Wednesday, Thursday or Friday? You can take a look at the duty roster again. Now you find that when they talk to each other, when Badru talked to Mr. Lee, they mention names like Patrice, Julie, Kai, and uh, Rahman. Right, okay, so check the library duty roster. Okay, so mark the answer for question B. Next, question 25. Based on the duty roster, list two tasks that you can do to help clean the library. What are the two tasks that you can do that you can help, okay, you can do to help clean the library. Now, this is very easy. So, take a look at the duty roster again. Say, 出列出两个 Task means 工作 两个工作你可以帮的 Okay, find the answer in the duty roster. 上面那边有四个工作 哪一个你觉得你可以做的 写下来,完了,that's all. Okay, so that's A. B. How do you think Mr. Lee feels when he finds out the librarians have not arrived yet? Why? Okay, check and see. See, uh, Mr. Lee actually asked, um, Good afternoon, Badro. Where are the rest of the librarians on duty today? See, so he, he actually asked Badro, about the librarians who are supposed to be on duty on that day. So this question asks you, this question asks you, how do you think Mr. Lee feels? No, and Kai just finished their lesson. Patrice is in the restroom. Raman is on the way from the staff room. You see, so all of them have not arrived. Okay, so the question asks you, did you hear Mr. Lee, our teacher, feel how? Can you 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 feel how? 还是紧张？开心、伤心、紧张。Okay, Do you know how to write 紧张 in English? 紧张. Okay, I have to give you. Okay, so if you listen to me, you get the answer. 紧张是 anxious. A N X I O U S. I repeat, A N X I O U S. Anxious. That's the word that you need to write. Okay, 紧张. So just write one word only. Mrs. Mr. Lee's feeling. Answer. A N X 
I O U S. Anxious. Ting tang. Okay. Then you give the reason. Nan Hong Ji okay. Li Yu na. Wei shen me ta jin zhang. Okay. And this answer is actually found in the passage. Wei shen me ta jin zhang. Yin wei. Yi jin shi liang dian la. Xia wu ban de session. Okay, so where can you find the answer? Look at the dialogue. Reason? It is almost 2 p.m. And, no need to write the word now. And the afternoon session is starting soon. Okay, we saw Jing Zhang, because it's already in the morning. So therefore, okay, so I repeat the answer. Given is the reason you can find the reason in the dialogue. It is almost 2 p.m. and the afternoon session is starting soon. Okay, so that's for the reason. And C. Look at C. It is important to be punctual. Punctual means 准时. Okay, it is important to be punctual. Do you agree? Do you agree? So your answer? Yes. It is important to be punctual. See, so always remember to answer the question. Do you agree? Ni tong ni ma tong ni shen ma. You say yes. It is important to be Okay, one line. Next line. Okay, which more jun si jung yao? Okay, which more jun jun si jung jun hen jung yao de ne? Answer below. This is because okay, you listen to me. 如果我们准时，如果我们准时。Can you write? 如果我们准时 If subject we verb are if we are punctual, comma, 谁会看到我们是有一个责任的人，然后他们就会尊敬我们 Okay, very simple answer. Okay, 如果我们准时我们的朋友，你可以讲，我们的朋友会看到我们是一个有责任的人，然后他们就会尊敬我们。Can you get the sentence? Okay, can I help you? 如果我们准时 ，comma， 我们的朋友，你可以讲别人，也可以 others or our friends。会看到我们 will see us as a responsible person. 就会看到我们是一个很有责任 responsible 就是责任的人 And they will 尊敬 respect us. Okay, can you spell the word responsible and the word respect? 看那个字，看那个下面那边有。这个两个字 ，OK， one is responsible， 就是有责任 ，respect， 尊敬 ，OK， I said again， 准时重要吗 ？Yes， 准时是很重要。为什么 ？Right below， 写下面，如果我们准时，我们的朋友就会看到我们是是一个很有责任的人 ，and。他们会尊敬我们。Can you get? If we are punctual, our friends will see us. 会看到我们。Will see, s e e, see us as a very responsible person. Responsible person. 
and responsible 就是有责任的人 ，and they will respect us， 他们会尊敬我们。Okay, check spelling of words. Eh, if you do not know. Okay, so that's for answer for question C, twenty-five C. Last exercise, page forty-eight. Look at section A. How to handle bullies? Now you're going to read the passage on your own. Read the notes. Use the information, and you will have to complete the text on page forty-nine. Okay. Now for this passage, I'm not going to help you. Now, I want you to check meaning of words. 查字典要写在旁边那个字什么意思？不会的字全部要查，查了就写在旁边那边。等下我要看你已经查字典了的。All right. Once you have finished, then you have to take a look at page forty-nine. Turn to page forty-six. Now, if you don't understand, you have to listen to me. Write the meaning of words that you don't understand at the top of the difficult word. All right. Okay. So let's take a look at the library duty roster. Look at the words at the top there. Study the library duty roster. Duty roster is 值日表 Okay. And this 值日表 is for the librarians. Librarians 就是图书馆员 Okay. So what are the their work, their duties in the library? So you can take a look at Monday from Monday to Friday, all right. So there are four different types of work. The first one is arrange tables and chairs. Second one, wipe the shelves and counter. Wipe, wipe 就是 mark, okay, mark 那些那些橱啊，那 shelves, chairs 啊 ，right. And the counter, counter is the 呃、uh, 柜台 okay. Then arrange books on the shelves and the last one, sweep the floor. All right, so and you can see different names. See, so every day somebody that will be the librarian, they will have to work in the library. All right, then you can read a dialogue. The dialogue between Badro and Mr. Lee. Badro says, "Good morning, Mr. Lee." Mr. Lee says, "Good morning, good afternoon, good afternoon, sorry, good afternoon, Mr. Lee." Mr. Lee says, "Good afternoon, Badro. Where are the rest of the librarians on duty today? They should be here by now." See, so. Um, Mr. Lee is asking Badro what happened to the rest of the librarians, and、uh, Badro say Julie and Kai are having lunch at the canteen. They finished their lesson a bit late just now. Patrice is in the restroom. Okay, the restroom is a could be a toilet, right? The restroom is a toilet. Raman is on his way from the staff room. He helped his teacher carry some books just now. All right, so these are. Okay, the people who are supposed to come for their duty in the library. All right, and Mr. Lee say, I see it's almost two p.m. now. The afternoon session is starting soon. You can start your duty first. And Badro say, All right, Mr. Lee, I'll start my duty now. Okay, so a very simple、um, dialogue, and I think you can understand the passage easily. Now, if you can't understand, please. Read again. 再读多一次，才可以答那个 page forty seven 的问题的。Homework to be sent for today's lesson is you need to take a picture of these two pages. Okay, so take a picture and then send it to us. That's all for today's lesson. Thank you. Subscribe the Explorer for more lessons. Have a nice day.